Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. If you always watch our channel, you may know that the news about the innovation of Chinese semiconductor chip industry. In order to ensure their global chip leadership, some countries have strictly restricted ASML, a lithography machine company, from providing lithography machines, especially EUV lithography machines, to China. This move made China's chip industry difficult to develop. But now there is finally good news. A research team led by Professor Huang Edong from Tsinghua University has successfully developed a meta-imaging chip. This means that maybe in the future, the chip manufacturing can get rid of the EUV lithography machine and directly image through the optical system, which also means that China's chip technology may also achieve a qualitative leap. First is the spectroscopy and optical imaging. The electromagnetic spectrum in the optical spectrum is currently being widely used in many industries. For this reason, many scientists are concentrating on studying this subject, wanting to develop more functions of it, and provide more convenience for our scientific research and life. What exactly is the optical spectrum? It is probably equivalent to the key that can be used by people to identify everything in the ever-changing world. This key can make the instruments in industrial manufacturing more precise, make medical examinations more detailed, and make our mobile phones and computers more agile. What about optical imaging? Optical imaging is a channel that provides possibilities for intelligent perception. Optical imaging technology can solve the problem of refraction of light in objects by tracing light. It can also know how to pass through other substances, and the object is imaged into multiple multiples, so as to analyze the required data. Optical imaging technology is very important to the research and manufacture of chips and the height of chip technology that can be achieved by using the technical principle of optical imaging is immeasurable. This represents the pivotal position of optics in the field of digitization. Second is the difficulties in optical imaging technology. Although optical imaging is very important to the development and creation of chips, there will be many obstacles in actual operation. Because optical imaging has always had great limitations, it is basically theoretically feasible, but the practicality is extremely low. Where are the specific disadvantages? The first is the problem of efficiency. The previous optical imaging technology can basically only perform foolish scanning operations, which makes it difficult to achieve the basic demands of people when using optical imaging. After all, this kind of efficiency is almost equivalent to chicken ribs in the field of chips that pursue high efficiency. The other is the problem that will be encountered when it is actually put into use. In the research process of optical imaging technology, how to solve the problem of excessive optical difference has always been the biggest bottleneck encountered by researchers. Light always encounters refraction problems during transmission, which leads to the fact that the ideal high-definition non-distortion effect cannot be achieved after the light actually reaches the transmission point. So for many years, many optical researchers have been looking for the answer to this technical difficulty, but no matter how many times they have done extremely fine experiments, they have not found a better solution. Therefore, optical imaging can only stop at the initial stage, and it is also difficult to use it in chip development. Third is the optical imaging and chip technology. This time, 
The research team from Tsinghua University in China changed their thinking and no longer blindly pursued radicalization. By merging the previous technologies on the same chip, the optical imaging no longer needs to break through the technical bottleneck. Can achieve the effect of making the chip more precise. As we all know, our country's chips have not been able to achieve major technological breakthroughs due to the problem of lithography machines. Although many scientists have been working on our own chips, without EUV lithography machines, everything is fantasy. Because at present, the prerequisite for making the world's most precise chips is the EUV lithography machine. However, EUV lithography machine technology has always been firmly controlled by other countries and it has been strangled by the most critical joints. Our country's chip technology has only progressed slowly for many years. So skipping the lithography machine and using other technologies to develop high-precision chips is the best way out for our country in the chip industry. Fortunately, this vision has finally been realized this year. The spectral imaging chip developed by the Tsinghua University team has a resolution of 0.8 nanometers. This kind of resolution means that in the future, the chips made by lithography in our country will be more precise, and it is even expected to exceed the precision of chips made by EUV lithography machines. After all, the world's highest known chip resolution of EUV lithography machines is 3 nanometers. The technological war has always been an invisible but fierce fighting war. Whoever masters the technology has the power to speak out, just like the complicated situation in the chip market. Our country has been forced to use a large number of imported chips due to technological limitations. Fortunately, our scientists have the spirit of not admitting defeat and also have the unquenchable dream of allowing Chinese people to use domestic chips. Finally, they let them overtake in a corner and found the correct direction from another way. Since then, domestic chips will stand out in the fierce competition in the chip market. Do you think domestic chips will be a dream come true? Thank you for your watching.